you make a hell of a lot more money when you're the champ. And when you go back down and have to work your way back up, you don't make as much money, right? Very rarely, unless you're maybe, I don't know, Daniel Cormier or Conor McGregor, one of those <laughs> kind of guys, you make the same. Am, am, I being, am I being dishonest, right? So that's just the nature of the beast. Nature if of the you, game. The guy is going to hold on to that belt so he can keep making those paychecks. And as Dana White himself said, this isn't a career. It's an opportunity. So keep making those paychecks. And, yeah, absolutely. It's on you to figure out how to stop it. And how to stay the champion. Look, Jorge Masvidal said in all these contract negotiations, remember he was saying, I was asking for more money from the pay-per-view, right? Asking for a... Here's where the, the, the problem comes for everyone right so now i don't i don't know the specifics of the contract but it would be very difficult for me to believe that now jorge masvidal made all this money in last weekend right he probably had a bigger his show money was more his pay-per-view it's hard for me to believe that now that he's not going to be fighting for a title is the money's probably going to come down and there will be no pay-per-view so all those things, right? Like if he's not main eventing a pay-per-view card, which we know today, most times pay-per-views are main evented by title fights. How are you getting pay-per-view dollars? You know, so if there's no pay-per-view dollars now, even Masvidal is going to have to take a bit of a pay cut. So holding on to that title is so important. Mm. I told you guys weeks ago, I thought I would stay the champion for a long time. So I made my money so much grander as a champ opposed to if I was challenging. It's a big time difference. It's a massive difference. Yeah. Is it so in, in this particular case, like with Masvidal, um, I still feel like I still feel like he'd be worth those pay-per-view dollars, like a cut of the pay-per-views. He's such a big star and he sold this so well. Well, the problem is like they don't they don't main event pay-per-views without title fights. Well, no, he did with Nate. Unless you count the BMF title, it, it, it was it was a title, right? Oh, they, made a, they made a <laughs> BMF title. So unless right. he's going to start defending the BMF title over and over again. Generally, the UFC puts a title fight atop of a pay-per-view card. That's just the way it is. Yeah. Um, what about the ending? Because I think that actually helped Masvidal a lot. Hugged it out, handled it well, showed up to do media. <laughs> would you would you think of that? You didn't like it? I was like, what are they friends now? These guys yeah. hate each other. Like, I mean, bro, like, come on, man. You like, and Jones didn't do that, right? No, no. I think he did after he beat me the second time, but I don't know. I was knocked out. I didn't remember. How would I know what the hell happened afterwards? You know, I don't know. <laughs> But no, we didn't like, no, we didn't. So you don't believe in that. Listen, man, I understand selling the fight. I understand bad, bad blood, but so weird how the moment the fight ends, everybody can be okay. Right. It's like so weird, right? Like me and Ben Askren talked about this. It was like such bad blood. Like you guys can't stand to be in the same space without Dana White shoving his hand in between you. But the yeah. moment the referee ends, it's like, Yo, we're good now, right? We're gonna run this thing back. Like, no, it's like not that that doesn't really make much sense to me. Like, no, it doesn't work like that. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus.